I got my bachelor's here. Um, I graduated in 2011 with my bachelor's in anthropology. And the primary reason that I came back was how I was treated by the professors in that department. Like they were invested in not just my academic success, but my success as a person. Um, so I knew that coming back to ETSU for my doctorate, I knew I needed to have the right kind of professors behind me that would support me and, you know, really mentor me in this field. And I definitely chose correctly. I'm a graduate research, research assistant um, in the CARE Women's Health Center. And I have had a ton of opportunity to work within that center to really kind of look at how um, reproductive health and women's health, specifically contraceptive access, is in the Southeast. I'd like to do advocacy work, so I'm starting with kind of understanding those big organizations and working within those big organizations and then pivoting to advocacy for specifically um, adolescent health. My biggest research interest is improving adolescent well-being. And my specific focus right now is contraceptive access. It's like looking at how can we improve access for adolescents and like enable them to advocate for their own reproductive welfare. So my beyond is like really what I wanna do is advocate for youth to be able to access the kind of reproductive health care that they need in order to make the right choices for themselves. I feel like as a GA and as a doctoral can candidate and student, um, I've been very lucky to be placed with Care Women's Health. Like I've learned a ton and um, my mentor, my committee chair is Dr. Kate Beatty and she's just awesome. Like I've learned not just a lot of, you know, of the nerdy like academic research stuff, but I mean, she's been instrumental in just helping me develop, you know, my leadership skills, my, you know, research skills, just everything beyond academia. Like she's been super instrumental in that and everyone within my, um, my department.